In this video, we will show you how to check if Hyper-V is enabled in Windows 11. In here, I will show you with three ways. The first and the easy, you can type comment in the comment prompt. Just select comment prompt or type cmd and run as administrator here. And in here, just type system info. Hit the enter. After you type system info and you are hit the enter, in here there is Hyper-V requirements. A hypervisor has been detected, so it is already enabled of these features. And the number second, rather than using the command prompt, you can just type system info if you are using Windows 10 or Windows 11 here. The system information on the system summary you can scroll down okay in here there is a hypervisor has been detected and you can see virtualization based security is running and this is more complete okay and the number three you can open your control panel and make sure the hypervisor is also enabled on the programs in here because sometimes it enable on BIOS but not enable in here. It can be a problem also. Select turn Windows features on or off. And you can see, in my case, hypervisor is already enabled in here. You can also enable hypervisor management tools. Okay. And then to make sure you can type hypervisor in my windows 11 there is have hypervisor manager and if you can run the virtual machine in here so your hypervisor is already enabled and as you can see i successfully run the virtual machine on the my hypervisor also to check how to verify if hypervisor already enabled on your Windows 11. Hope this video helpful for you.